Hello YouTube. Today I'm going to be playing a custom map. This custom map is called the Hampshire Test Facility. And that's all I've really got to say, so let's get on with it. So you wake up like this sand house with roof windows. So it's daylight outside. Hello and welcome to the Hampshire Test Facility. Please enter for briefing. I'll do that right away. Rule 1. Do not destroy any blocks. Rule 2. Only destroy blocks if hinted. Right. Rule 3. Take any items from the chests provided. I'll do that. And Rule 4. Use the bed to reset your spawn point. Okay. Seems pretty simple. I see no buttons to get in. Oh, okay. Let's try again. Okay. Oh, and use the buttons located by the doors to open them. Okay, so let's start. There's no way back from here. Fair enough. So, we will now start the hamster test facility. Don't destroy the TNT, just leave it alone. Okay, so we just got up here, I assume. Try not to get set on fire. Yeah, spoke too soon. Okay, what? I, so I can't go up this way. Oh. What do we mean? Okay, so the next bit's there, but I can't get to it. Wait till my fire's gone. Let's just go. Down. Oh. Okay, I'm playing on peaceful. So now I'm at the top. Hopefully I'll stop being sound fire here. I didn't speak there. Just concentrating too much. Let's just wait for fire to go. Oh there we go. So well done. Stage one. Pass. It's good. <laughs> sort of failed that quite a bit. So there's two routes. Mint's got the right one. I went up the left one. So this that was the easy bit. Well, not for me. I'm not very good at Minecraft, but I'm sure everyone else who plays this does that fine. Anyway, so let's take the drop now. Okay, let's go down. And get out of the water. Good. I'm not giving you any clues for this bit. Please, could you play on peaceful? I am playing on peaceful. So, there you go. So, ah, uh, the ladder walk. I've jumped from one ladder to another. Seems pretty simple. I spoke too soon. Jump across to here. I normally fail on these jumps here. Oh, like I did there. Okay, I've made it, good. And cross there, and there we go. Well done, stage two, pass. Oh, here's a bed, let's reset my spawn. I can only sleep at night. There's a surprise. This way. So I assume I'm meant to jump from here over to there. Seems pretty simple. Yes, I know we failed those. Which way? This is a maze. Hmm. I'm gonna go straight on. See where I go. What's around here? And I'm back to the start. Let's go this way. Oh, hold on. I saw a sign there. Yep, there's a sign there. Let's go towards the sign. Exit. Oh, I can't get up there. <laughs> okay, so I can't get up there. So there's a path there. Okay, so. I know where I need to go there. The exit must be, well, must be here. Here we go. And that's where I was before with the paintings sign. Just there. And now the exit. Here we go. Oh, another bed to reset my spawn. Can you sleep at night still yet? Yeah, of course, it's not night yet. You'll need a few items from the chest. Don't use all the items because this is all we got. 
I'll take one of each. I'll put them in my inventory. So, I've got to somehow get across to that there. And on the floor, it's sand and a soil block. And I've got tree sapling, bone meal, and a, what's it called? It's called flint and steel. Sorry, I'm yes, I'm using too many the too many items mod. I won't be using it to cheat. And I've just taken the items from the chest. I just forgot the name of it. I thought it was tinder and something. So we we'll probably have to plant a tree here, and then hopefully a tree will grow and I'll be able to go across. I have, and then why? And then the reason why I got bone meal, so I can make bone meal, like just like that. And then I use the bone meal on the tree, and the bone meal makes a tree grow. And the tinder, that's probably to burn your tree down or something. I oh, know, but now I can go across. It's very, I have to admit, that is quite a clever level. I think you meant to light your tree afterwards or something. Anyway, stage three, pass. That's good. Now it's a cactus thing. It's good. So can't go here. It's lot. Oh, where do I go? Do I go here? Wait. Oh, here I go. Remember, oh, there's sign there. Remember, oh, what? Oh, no. Remember, don't destroy the TNT block. I won't be doing that. Anyway, stage four pass. Still can't see when we set my sword. So that's stage four done. Um, can I, oh, can I get out here? No. Oh no, can't get out. <laughs> Thought there's a fault. A stage four pass. It's a very short stage, just the cactus. Now let's go for oh, oh very sneaky. Putting a disposer there with an arrow, very sneaky. I didn't see that. It's probably very obvious. I, I didn't see that, it's very sneaky. So yay, the chest is really empty. And don't know what the point of that chest is. So what do I do here? I seem to have to jump to that block there or something. Just like that. There's water there, probably if you jump in the lava and you set on fire. So I have to open this door, and I assume that one of these do Oh, it's going to take ages. So it's probably only one of these that works, or... Com if it's combination, I'm never going to do it. Oh, there we go. Yep, it's that lever there. So that opens the door. Good. And okay, both buttons work. So, what was stage one? Ascent through lava or cactus maze? Well, that's a cactus maze just there. So, must be ascent through lava. Yes, it was because you're in the underground cave and you have to go up the path beside the lava. So. I guess it's a sent through lava. Ooh, hello, piggy. How many gold ingots do you need to make a gold block? The answer to that is nine. Am I right? Yes, I am. I'm going for a full run here. What do cows drink? Water or milk? Ha ha, very funny. They drink water. It's definitely not milk. Oh, lots of pigs around here. Stage five, pass. Let's get through the door. Okay. Okay button here. Oh hello piggy, more pigs. Can't sleep yet? No, can I sleep at night? Hello piggy. You're in my way. Oh I can get out here. I think I'm not meant to go out here. Okay. Small fault. You're not meant to be able to get out there. I think you're meant to go straight on. But anyway. Use the pork drops to drop onto the pressure pads to open the doors. So I need to use the pork chops. I've got pigs here, they provide pork chops. Okay, there's press pads. Oh, there's a button on the side door so I can open it. Oh. Right, so there's pressure pads here. Now, what happens if I put something on them? Oh, so the pressure pads open doors. Well, I've already got some bone meal here, which I'm sure I'm not going to be able need to use again. Oh, 
So I need three more pork chops. So what happens? So it opens the door. So two doors have been opened from two of the pressure pads. So I need three pork chops. Yes, press the button. Oh, there's pork chop there. Two more pork chops to go. So there's a pig spawner here, spawning the pigs. Just here. Probably used a mod for that or something. Oh, yes! He dropped two pork chops. Thank you, pig. So now I can do the rest. should be all the doors opened. Yep it is. And this one you can go up. Oh. That's the my that's the circuit behind it. <laughs> I don't think I was meant to do that. Say six pass. Bed tree set my spawn. Yay, I can finally sleep and I think I'm gonna stop the video there, so well, let's resume it later. That's part one. I'll be bringing part two out. Please watch that. So goodbye.